So here we are, our next camp for the night at Birdsville. Uh, we rocked in just on five o'clock and went straight to the pub. Decided to get in early and get a meal while we could. Very sadly, it was a very disappointing meal. Um, Jason and I both had a steak and uh, look, I understand that they have a lot of people that come through with the bash and everything. Um, so they have it like in Bay Marie's and things like that. But all our, our food was like cold. Um, they're all medium, which I like my steak medium, but I like my steak medium. Quarter of it I couldn't eat, it was quite under. We had to eat with plastic cutlery because apparently um, over a few years people stole the cutlery our beers on tap were served in plastic cups which i can't stand again because people were stealing the glassware so you know pretty disappointing really um they used to have a beautiful outdoor fire pit at the birdsville pub but someone fell into it a couple of years ago so they've had to remove that too so really really sad to say we won't bother going back to the pub it was quite disappointing um for us um, Chelsea had the lasagna, she said 10 times over how nice it was, so <laughs> you know, at least she was happy I guess. But we've um, had our meal, it was food, we've come down the road and we're camping on the common uh, in Birdsville um, and so it's another free camp. A lot of the first bump in uh, bashes have already gone in so there's quite a lot of space uh, available on the common for us to pull up. So. It's great we're just setting up now we'll get a nice fire going and we're just happy to be here and tomorrow we will move on so I'll flip you around the one thing we always absolutely loved about going through the Simpson Desert and up these parts is their skies and their sunsets they are absolutely magical And hear all the birds roosting for the evening. So that's us, birds full. Until tomorrow, we'll check back in then. See ya.